Mello is money. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, accompanied by John Cena from Boston, Massachusetts. Weighing in at 210 pounds, Carmelo Hayes. I hate to parrot a catchphrase, but Mello really is money. Multiple title reigns and main events to his name already. And this guy is destined to continue that success in all of WWE. Mello ready to do something special. An absolute in-ring phenom. Already so much success and limitless expectations for the future. Paul Heyman from Woodstock, Georgia, weighing in at 230 pounds from Breaker. Within two years of his debut, he won the NXT Championship twice and unified it with the NXT UK title. Many more titles in this young man's future. You don't need to be a math major to realize that tonight spells disaster for Braun Breaker's opposition. Or the entire WWE locker room. And we kick things off with Braun Breaker's son and nephew of a pair of Hall of Famers, but fast becoming a power in his own right. If you could bottle potential up and put it in a human being, you'd get someone like Braun Breaker. He's got his dad's natural ability, his uncle's genetic freakishness. It's easy to see why Breaker's asserted himself so quickly. The kid's undeniable. Perhaps some of that potential will be realized tonight. And up against him is the supremely talented, supremely confident Carmelo Hayes. The only thing more dangerous than a confident man is a man who could back it up. Hayes is damn good and he knows it. We could be in for a show tonight, fellas. Oh, man, a little extra luster behind that kick. Hurting the shoulder. And A's turning it around. Elbow smash! What a curve line. Carmelo Hayes has a lot going for him tonight, Corey, but what does he have going against him? Overconfidence. Carmelo deservedly believes his own hype, but we know that can backfire too. Melo needs to keep his head in the game. Just punched him right in the mouth. Relentless. Enough already. Punches to the ear? How are they going to hear after this match? A bear hug, squeezing the breath out of him. I'm not quite furiously trying to fight his way out of the bear hug. Can he do it? Yes. And the line. Constant pressure being kept on Braun. Tough spot for Braun to be in. Oh, they drop across the wall. And this match will head back to the ring. Uh-oh. Ooh, got caught with a punch to the face. That's gonna hurt. Moves like that is why Carmelo has the confidence that he has. Done without a sweat. 
People simply can't do the things Melo does. Time to wallow in disbelief. Pressure must be kept on. Run through with the spear. Pure natural ability on display from Brock Breaker. That might have looked even better than when his daddy did it. Almost inhuman at this point. No! Somersault plunge out of the floor. Absolutely throwing all caution to the wind. Spinning in the face of danger. Just cranking the head. Well-framed standing moonsault. Oh, just deadlifting their opponent and tossing them aside. And now thrown back into the ring. Carmelo's got to find a way out of this dire spot. Spends off the attack with an elbow right across the face. Drives his opponent down with a urinagi. He's starting to struggle here. Not a bad place to be in, but the longer this goes, the more trouble a superstar exposes themselves to. Took him out at the knee. Rod Breaker daring his opponent to... Okay, consider that a harsh lesson. Face first in the turnbuckle. Counters! Bicycle knee to the face. Scary pattern starting to form as that upper area takes more damage. This could be it. Cover for the win. He gets the kick out after the one. These one counts are going to get harder and harder to kick out of. a career-altering moment for these superstars, guys. But the spoils will only go to the victor. I have a feeling we're close to finding out exactly who that will be. Two! Kicks out. This is going to come down to who wants it more. Breaker now, getting in position. Back elbow completely cuts them off. No surprise that what we're witnessing is trending. Forget trending on social media. The motion in the arena is starting to lift their scale. On a top to war with Cyborg Slam. He's just getting beaten on all fronts here. At this point, it might be too much for him to recover from, Cole. Oh. Oh, straight to the floor. Wildly throwing your body out of the ring like that is more often than not going to provide such a result. That was an example of boldness backfiring. And he tosses him back in now. Three. Left side. Oh. Buster. <laughs> and he saw that coming from Braun. But yes, it's now suplex. <laughs> Boot to the stomach gives them separation. Shoulder up 
in time. And there needs to be a refocus now. That was the moment that could have ended things. A moment that's being replayed in their heads right now. Oh, is that really called for? The volume in this building has increased exponentially. The fans are willing these competitors to push forward. Win or lose, these superstars are going to be held in high esteem after this one. He's going for it all. Stirring back to his feet, but he might not know where he is. Hayes hits nothing but net. Can Hayes put things away here? Two count. And picks up a monumental victory. Here is your winner, Carmelo Hayes. A taxing victory here. Getting it done the hard way. Putting your body on the line like that is a huge risk. This match could have gone very differently. But in the end, Corey, they are the ones celebrating.